We are getting into the rainy part of spring and we've seen some major storms roll through and how important is it to you for you to know your flood zone? Well, the answer is it's pretty important. This next segment has been sponsored by the Metropolitan St. Louis Sewer District and joining me this afternoon is Nicole Spencer, spokesperson with MSD. Thank you so much for joining me today. Yeah, thanks for having us. Absolutely. Healthy. And this is so important. I mean, you guys really do care and are concerned about people here in St. Louis and MSD's Project Clear wants everyone to educate themselves on their flood risk. Let's talk a little bit more about it. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, as you know, we've had these heavy rains over the past several years. Uh, they continue to get more frequent, and so we want people to know their zone. And by that, we mean know which flood zone you live in. Um, the, the Federal Emergency Management Agency has uh, flood zones high, moderate, or low risk, and so we want people to know which zone they live in. Uh, they can learn that at knowyourzone.org and then know what actions they might need to take to protect themselves when we have those heavy rains. Yes, and that is so important. And knowing your zone means knowing about flood insurance too. What does that mean? Yeah, so flood insurance is something that people should certainly consider. Um, most of the St. Louis region lives in a low or moderate risk zone. So if you live in a high flood risk zone, you're required to have that flood insurance. But most of the uh, flood claims that we see come from those low or moderate risk zones. And so look into flood insurance if you feel like that's something that you need. I know that a lot of homeowners policies don't cover flood mm -hmm. insurance. Um, but if they do, then certainly take advantage of that. There's also a national flood insurance program that you can look into as well. And I know it can be costly. Flood insurance is costly, but the average flood damage claim is $35,000. And that's a lot. I don't know about you, Chelsea. I don't have $35,000 <laughs> <No. laughs> sitting around to take care of something like that. And that is so important. And that's why you guys are on a mission to continue to educate people because no organization covers those losses, including MSD. And let's talk a little bit more. We want to look at the flood map. We just mentioned it, you just talked about it, but knowing that zone is truly imperative. What can homeowners do when those streams, those creeks, they do flood and their homes get impacted? They do, yeah. So we see a lot of overland flooding and that's when a lot of heavy rain falls in a very concentrated area in a short period of time. Uh, there are things that people can do around their home to help protect themselves as well. Uh, cleaning out their window wells, keeping their gutters clear, um, looking on your street and seeing if you have any storm inlets, making sure those are clear. Um, those things can certainly help yourself, you know, in those times when we have those heavy rains. Um, but again, knowing your zone, knowing where you live, doing your part to make sure that you're protected and your neighbors are protected as well. Knowledge is power. Knowledge, Knowledge is always is power. power. And let's talk a little bit more about Prop S. It just passed. What can MSD Project Clear do since this legislation? Yeah, I'm glad that you brought that up because it is very recent. Uh, so Proposition S is going to allow MSD uh, to work on some stormwater issues. Um, the best way to think about that is it's really going to allow us the funds to be able to build stormwater infrastructure where it doesn't currently exist and then also bring some of that other stormwater infrastructure up to speed. But it's important to note that you can't engineer your way out of every single problem. And so while we will be doing our part to bring those stormwater uh, sewers up to speed, we also still need people to know their zone so that they can do their part as well in those places where we can't engineer our way out of the problem. Full circle moment right there. It all comes back to knowing your zone and making sure you are covered with flood insurance. If you're at home, you're watching, and you don't actually know your zone, well, guess what? That's why MSD is here today. All you have to do is head online to their website, visit Know Your Zone. .org. You can also file, find and follow MSD Project Clear online. KnowYourZone.org. Follow Facebook, Instagram, and on X at MSD Project Clear. All of those handles are right there on your screen. And we'll make sure you have access to all of those details on our website at studiostl.tv. Don't go anywhere. St. Louis will be right back after this quick break.